This is a fantastic trick everyone should follow, not only for beginners, but if beginners are going to follow this trick, definitely they can speak English efficiently. Okay, what is the trick? Are you so excited to know about it? Okay, wait for a while. Let me explain it briefly. I have a habit of uh, thinking about some incidents in present moment. Okay, so I am I am at present moment. See, I am going to think about the actions or the incident which happened yesterday or day before yesterday. See, assume me as, as a beginner. So, I am going to think in this way. Okay, I am going to take a role of... Uh, the person uh, who is uh, struggling to speak English. So I am going to take that role and I am going to act in front of you. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. I am going to think the first sentence, what did I do yesterday? First thing, I woke up at 5 a.m. yesterday. That's great, fine. Then what did I do? I think I refreshed myself. Then I went to kitchen. Okay, what did I do? What did I do in the kitchen? I drank some water because I felt thirsty. Mm, good. Then what did I do? Ah. So I went to take the milk from the refrigerator. Okay, then what did I do? I heated the milk. Then I turned the milk into coffee. That's great. I made a, a cup of coffee. Okay, after that I took a cup of coffee to my daughter. She too drank. Got it? So I have used the third person also. She, she too drank. Great. See, I have been making, you know, many sentences with the subconscious mind. So here I want to reveal, this is the major trick. Even a beginner, even a person who speaks well, should think in this way every day. So if every day morning, wake up early and sit for five minutes and think about the incident or the uh, a, you know actions which happened yesterday this is the powerful technique if you follow this definitely you can speak english within five days of your practicing time so i challenge you today if you want to become a challenger follow this trick okay okay let me continue so i am playing the role of beginner okay have it in your mind always i'm i'm playing the role of beginner okay then what did i do i gave uh, coffee then she drank okay that's great fine then i got ready to shoot a video say got ready got it so i got ready to shoot a video then i took a video okay and i started to edit the video say so it was so sunny so i fell to drink juice so i made uh, juice pomegranate juice that's great fine so I, it was so tasty you can make use of some other adjectives it was, it was so delicious to drink that's great fine see here and there you can make use of some adjectives so try to make use of some vocabularies build your vocabulary see your thought process is very important if your thought process is very dull if you find it very difficult to make even sentence you need to think about the words around you first. See, when you think about the words around you, try to connect all these words with a particular noun. That is very, very important. So as I informed you already in another video, you need to grab all the things around you and try to make several sentences using those objects. Then using those objects, try to make several questions. See, this is the way you can build your confident level. Yes, I hope you, you have been following it. Anyhow, uh, I have given wonderful trick to build your confident level, making an incident perfectly using one tense, that is past tense. So the second column, you must use only verb to. Don't forget. So it is really fantastic idea, feel so. And I'm going to give you another trick. So this is going to be your second trick. Kindly follow this. See, actually, if you must become a very good person who plans the things what will happen tomorrow. You must have a paper, take a paper and write down the things. What are you going to do tomorrow? If you have this policy, you can easily plan the things and you can execute it properly. Uh, let me just give you a sample uh, thing which will make you to frame many sentences on your own using future tense. Okay, this is my plan.
I will wake up very early because I need to complete many tasks tomorrow because uh, of this reason I must wake up very early. So I must wake up. So must is an auxiliary word verb and I am supposed to use that must uh, wherever I want to stress on that particular action. Got it? So I must wake up very early. Then I must pray. So it is very essential to begin a day with prayer. Correct? Okay, the next thing, uh, uh, I will meet my friend. I don't know that I, I may have, be, I may have some uh, project work. So I, I will meet my friend. Then what will I do? I will discuss about the plans and I will give the schedule to my friend. Okay, that's all. So the meeting will be over. Then what will I do then? Uh, I will take my uh, daughter outside. Outside in a sense near my house. Uh, because of this uh, quarantine period, I cannot take her outside due to coronavirus. Okay, the spread is really, uh, you know, furious now. So, we should be very careful at home. Then, you know, I can take my daughter outside uh, for a while and I can just make her to feel the fresh air outside. So, she will enjoy that. Okay, so I will make her to feel the uh, fresh air. See, this is the way you have to make sentences. Then, uh, we will take some photos. Okay. Okay, have command over your subconscious mind and try to remind the things and I'm going to execute it tomorrow. So what am I going to execute it? I will play with my daughter tomorrow. I have planned it already, right? So I will play with my daughter tomorrow. Whatever you have planned already can be executed in the future tense. So you can use I will, I will, I will. Try to use I will. Yes. So this is the way you can improve your fluency level, especially your conversation. And try to make several questions and try to ask many questions. This is the way you have to think elaborately. So if you start doing, if you start practicing in this way, definitely within 5 days, within 10 days, you can see tremendous changes in your conversation. See, if you want to... Uh, move to the next stage you have to take the next next step to improve your skill if you don't take any steps if you if you are a person who is a mere observer you cannot help yourself if you want to become uh, uh, the if you want to follow this proverb self help is the best help if you want to follow this proverb self help is the best help so if you want to be the person who wants to help yourself and others definitely you can follow this uh, challenge so i challenge you that within 10 days or within 15 days you can improve your english if you start following these two tricks and try to practice uh, try to um, you know uh, make a conversation or uh, build your confident level in front of camera try to record some sentences on your own and talk with your friends in this way and have a schedule have your own plan every day and what are you going to do tomorrow just try to use future tense and make several sentences or try to ask uh, many questions to yourself so this is the way you can build your uh, uh, you know confident and uh, it is going to be the strong bridge this is the only way you can improve your english so if you have liked this video, just like the video and comment below and try to share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching. I'll come with another beautiful topic and it is going to change, transform you totally. Possible English provides you online classes. Okay, we have three ways to achieve your goal. One is beginner level, another is advanced level English and uh, the last one is one-to-one -one classes. So if you are interested to know about our courses, kindly contact us immediately. Thank you for watching and kindly follow the instruction whichever I have given.